What's going on, fellow Crusaders? So Crusader Actual here, again, with another Amberlin Reed reaction. So today I'm going to do things a little different. So I'm going to react to uh, a video that was requested uh, by one of my viewers, Paula. Um, so this video isn't done by Amberlin, which I've done, like, all of my videos in the past have been from her channel. Um, so this one's actually going to be from, I think, someone that everyone in the Amber reaction compilation all that in that scene i guess you would call it uh highly respects and that's uh, apathetic facts so chances are if you've seen my videos you've probably seen apathetic facts i'd imagine and if you haven't for whatever reason uh highly highly recommend their channel i'll link this video uh and their uh, uh their channel in the description below so like i said highly recommend checking out apathetic facts they're like do amazing amberlin read compilations there and they're extremely funny uh, and it saves you from giving Amberlynn any uh, unnecessary views that she doesn't need. So, you know, before we get into the reaction looking at this video, so you all need to ask yourselves, right, like, and try to sympathize with what we're about to see. Like, you've all been there, right? Going to Walmart at 2 a.m., uh, you have to get, like, your fucking Oreos and, like, your TV dinners and all that bullshit. And it sucks getting there and having to walk around and you realize that you didn't wear the right shoes. You wore your flats again. You told yourself you weren't going to do it. But you keep forgetting. You keep always having to wear your flats. So, of course, you're going to drive the scooter around Walmart, right? Like, that's the logical choice. And, like, we've all been there before, right? So, today I'm going to react to Apathetic, Fa Apathetic Facts' compilation of all the times Amberlynn Reed has complained about wearing the new shoes and has to justify whatever she's doing, like riding in a cart and all that. Uh, because she wore the wrong shoes. So without further ado, let's get into the video. All right, so here we see November 2013 is the first time that she complained about the wrong shoes. So it's crazy. I guess I'm always wrong because I, I always mess up her timeline. Like, I forget she's been on YouTube for this long. It's pretty wild. So she's been on YouTube for freaking nine years at this. Well, almost, like short of nine years, uh, which is wild to me. There they are, the notorious flats. More flats. Our feet hurt so bad. Like, I don't even have words for how bad our feet hurt. Rain and oh my god! Drop. <laughs> Is anyone... Oh my god, that's so cringy. I see it all the time, but like, has anyone, does anyone know what video that's actually from? Like, her trying to sing or whatever? I'd love to actually see the video and like, react to it, cause like, it's so cringy, dude. It's the ridiculous. Wrong shoes. Pa. Pa. And she actually recorded herself doing it. That's amazing. Good for uh, her. my bra showing. Yeah, the, the, <laughs> the PTSD bra, yeah. I literally just tried on so many shirts. This was April 2013. She's only 350 pounds at this point and was riding a scooter. <laughs> yeah, it's true. And it's just like segued into her continuously riding a scooter like every time she goes to Walmart. There's a bunch of people in that aisle, so we're gonna have to wait. I'm wondering why I use this. It's because it's 2 a.m. Destiny just does it because like, I feel stupid doing it, and, but I really do it because of my heel spur. Walmart at 2 a.m., I don't understand. And of and course- I've had a really long day and I'm wearing the totally wrong shoes and it hurts really bad. And that's every time though. So it's like, I love like, and it's funny too, cause I assume what this video is gonna do is there's always gonna, like she's gonna show every clip that we have so far of her riding in the scooter and complaining about the wrong shoes, which is insane. That like every time she has to mention like all her fucking self-diagnosed issues. And I assume she's never gonna go see a fucking doctor about him either, so, whatever. And if you guys are wondering, yes, I am sitting in one of these little... Oh my god. ...carts. There's like already shit in her cart, too. You will never believe what's wrong with me. No. We were legit we walking from... Walking. Um, Crystal's car. But we were walking and for some reason, I got these new shoes, they're actually flats, but they have a little bit of a hill, hill to it and I'm not really like used to that because I'm used to really, really flat shoes. And I was walking and there was like a hole type of thing, like a pothole. A hole type of thing. 
in the um <laughs> like a fucking crater in the ground parking lot and i hurt my ankle like legit i almost went home and i was like you know what i'm not even gonna shop like what's even the that's dedication though she's like legit walmart's like number one supporter like she tripped in a massive fucking hole that was unavoidable and like still decided to go to Walmart. Point. Like that's amazing. Fun land. Like this whole thing happened. But if most people had dedication like that to anything, like but the world would be a better it place. Happens. And I remember um, about a year ago, I was actually shopping in, okay, no, not a year ago, about eight months ago, I was shopping at Walmart and I was doing a vlog and I was sitting in one of these because I hurt myself again, which is, something that happens frequently but um which i i don't understand i mean whatever because i was having like blisters and stuff and someone left a really rude comment and i just didn't think it was nice so i kind of just wanted to let you guys know that yes i'm sitting in one of these again because i hurt my ankle and i'm hoping it's okay and, and you're um, gonna keep doing it I'll keep all the time posted. this sucks because it's honestly embarrassing being and it doesn't matter that you're embarrassed you don't give a fuck a fat girl riding this cart around when i could easily just walk oh <gasps> Someone might actually need that wheelchair, you know? She wants me to push oh, it. Oh, please don't get in it. Uh, of course. Destiny's dumbass. Rain and pedals, these drop. I wore the wrong shoes. So we've had a long day. I'm wearing the wrong shoes. And my feet hurt. And and she always complains about having a long day at work. Does Didn't it, like, come out that she only worked, like... She claimed to work full time and like work all the time and go up and continuously like volunteer and shit just so she could a be around Destiny if they had different schedules. But I heard that she only did like actually worked half time and like worked maybe or excuse me part time and worked like four hours maybe a day a couple of times a week and probably just bitched the whole time. And so of hers. So everybody and their mother uses this thing. Like, everybody. So that's the justification now. It doesn't matter that she wore the wrong shoes. It's the fact that everybody does it. Like, she... Fucking God, dude. She does that with everything. It, like, doesn't matter. It's like, if someone else does it, she has to be able to do it. We see, like, skinny people. And it's so annoying, too, that fucking Destiny fucking old, does it. Young people, old people, purple people, yellow people. I have never... I don't know. I could never bring myself, even if I was hurt, to, like, ride in one of those carts. And, like, I've never even seen young people do it unless they're, like, stupid fucking, like, young... Not stupid, but, like, they're young kids just, like, acting up and, like, riding around in one for no reason. Carrot people. I just saw carrots, so I said that. Like, everybody. Yes, Turkey. I'm sitting in one of these because my foot hurts really bad, but I still, like, get up and try to walk and stuff, so... The fuck? I was literally a couple stores down from target but i told her i'm not walking that far my feet and legs are always hurting even when i'm not working like they're just always hurting because what was that fucking accent i work all the time and i'm wearing um flats right now and of course as one does See, and, I, and it's like even more, like she's walking around, like getting her steps in and flat. So clearly the shoes aren't an issue. Like she's walking around in grass and shit. I have never, maybe because I like don't know enough, but are the, is there actual footage of her wearing normal ass, like athletic shoes or anything like that? Like, I don't think I've actually seen any like documented proof of her wearing anything other than flats. My God. really good with my walking and such and it was this last step right here oh no she hurt herself self on the stoop that's like her safe place she's always hanging around on that stoop i guess my foot got caught or something and i fell literally my whole body fell forward like that's got to be alarming though being that heavy and falling like dude <laughs> like fuck. i was standing and then my body just i felt which i feel like this is a lie just how she talks about it, but like I imagine though that's pretty scary. Look at a little twinkie back there. I wear flats every time I leave the house and yeah, every time really every day, all day we get it. Experiences this. But after I wear flats and I take them off, the bottom of my feet are like baby butt soft. No, dude, that's not like you being unique or anything. It's fucking because you never like use your feet. You don't walk like your feet are just like unused. So yeah, they're going to be fucking soft. It's like if you don't like work with your hands at all, like you, you're going to have soft hands like 
Dumbass. I don't know what it is. They're not sweaty or anything like that. Like, that's weird. I don't but think anyone like implied that. And, like, the softness of a really soft pair of socks or something. And our floor, we don't have Why any she carpet just... at all. <laughs> She's... Like, she has to, be, like, have all these positive... Like, she just, like, complimented her feet, like, eight times. Like, okay, and so shut up. we had just gotten home from somewhere, and I was sitting on my bed, which is on the floor. I prefer my bed on the floor. I'm able to get up fine. I had... <laughs> we need a compilation of all the times her, be her fucking bed's been identified just, like, on the floor in a random place. Like, in fucking living room and stuff like that. I just taken off my flats so the bottom of my feet were super soft i don't understand why this happens it's so weird but i had to go to the bathroom so i was getting up off the bed and to get up off the bed i do this little like turny bit and i get up by using like the strength in my feet <laughs> listening to amberlyn read this like describe how to do anything is amazing like, I had to get up using the strength of my feet. Okay. My feet slipped from under me, and I Which landed I don't on my think left that knee. Happened. It terrified me. This night actually scared me a bit more, because this time I was wearing my flats. I decided, you know what, if I'm going to start getting up off the bed, and my freaking feet are so damp that I'm going to slip on this, like, flooring. What'd she edit out there? she say they were damp? And it, but if I'm gonna be slipping now, um, I wanna just have shoes on that have a grip, and my flats do have a grip. Rain. Oh my god. Pedals, these drop. I wore the wrong shoes. So we're at Walmart right now. Destiny just dropped me off in front. I don't really talk about this, but I've been having like this foot issue. It was my ankle, and now it's my heel, and it hurts really bad. The heel spur. Sometimes hurt. I stand up and I physically can't even move, and it's, I don't know, it's really bad. Everyone keeps saying I should go to the hospital, and I'm just like, no. Of course not. Why would she fucking actually seek medical, like, professional help? Like, yeah, why the so, fuck not? She just let me out in the front, because it just really hurts, especially after a long day at work, like. Yeah, you're three I or mean, four I hours of work. Bad. Okay. It's like my heel. But she has to get to Walmart, though. That's what's very admirable about all this, is, like, nothing will stop this woman from hoarding her fucking shit at Walmart. I can't explain it. Rain and pedals, these drop. <laughs> I wore the wrong shoes. I still can't believe she did this. <sighs> Two minutes and 19 seconds of walking. In flats, though. So, two minutes and 19 seconds. This is a wee bit disheartening. It is really hot out here, and I told you my breathing. There's, okay, one excuse. Isn't that great today? Two. My back hurt. Really? <laughs> and also, yeah, your breathing sucks because obviously you don't do anything that tests like your cardiovascular system fucking sucks. So, okay. Mm, and pedals, these drop. I wore the wrong shoes. Pa. <laughs> pa. Like, all right, guys, so kind of a short one today. Uh, but yeah, that's the video. So, a couple of key takeaways from this, right, is that nothing will stop Amberlyn Reed from going to Walmart. Like, nothing. Like, heel spurs, fucking wrong shoes back pain it doesn't matter like she's gonna go to walmart and buy like her dumb shit that she hoards and all that so that's i mean again i think that's a positive like i i will commend her for that that's impressive like for her to experience all these ailments but still go to walmart like on a daily basis so that's that's great and the second key takeaway obviously is to be prepared for anything right like you know like make sure whenever you go out you have your best pair of flats on standby at all times ready to go because you never know when you're gonna be confronted with the issue of wearing the wrong shoes so anyway guys hope you all enjoyed the video uh, again a uh, big shout out to apathetic facts for uh actually creating that video that i just reacted to uh apathetic facts content is amazing as you can tell like it's very it's very funny she has uh, Apathetic Facts includes a bunch of uh, great injects and stuff that just make makes the content that much better. Uh, like I said, I'll put the uh, link to the video and Apathetic Facts' channel below. Please check them out if you have not uh, seen them already. And consider subscribing to them and liking their videos because they definitely, definitely uh, deserve it, I think. And awesome, just have great content. But anyway, guys, that's it for me today. Uh, you know, again, like I said... And just like on a quick note, um, videos might slow down a little bit uh, with things that are going on in the world. Uh, work is picking up a little bit, so uh, my free time's a little short. Uh, but hopefully I'll see y'all again soon. 
Uh, but yeah, y'all stay safe out there. I'll see y'all next time.